Let's take a look at comments in JavaScript. Comments are a way to add notes and explanation to your code that are not actually executed when the code runs. They are a great way to document your code and make it easier for others to understand. In JavaScript, there are two types of comments, single line comments and multi line comments. Single line comments start with two forward slashes and they can only be written on one line. This is what they look like. If we save our file, our comment doesn't really run. It's just there for us and other developers to read. Multi-line comments serve the same purpose, but can span multiple lines and have a different syntax. They start with a forward slash and an asterisk and end with an asterisk and a forward slash. This is what it looks like. Now I can add line breaks to this comment and you'll notice it still remains as a comment because as I said before, this is a multi-line comment. It's important to use comments in your code to make it easier to understand and maintain. However, you should also be careful not to overuse them. Too many comments can make your code harder to read and can distract from the actual code. It's best to use comments when you're trying to explain complex blocks of code or possibly when you're trying to mark a section that is a work in progress. Or you might even write to do tasks for your code. It's also important that you don't use comments to explain very obvious code. Let's take a look at our previous code example. If you have a line of code that says console.log hello world, it's pretty obvious what this code does. So writing comments like this prints hello world doesn't really make any sense because our code is pretty self-explanatory. And this is really all you need to know about comments in JavaScript.